welcome. This is not the bridges. Um, this is actually another thing that I've been working on lately. It is, if you ever played the game FTL, Faster Than Light, I'm trying to rebuild the same mechanic, but first person in Minecraft, so that would be pretty cool. Um, right now I'm in the turbo lift. Um, I'll show you around the ship. Well, actually, let me show you where you start off. This is where you start off. Go up here, you're in the bridge. Um, you slash start, so start. Um, welcome to space. You are alone out here and have nothing but the company of the space noise to comfort you. Take a while to explore before you begin. When you're ready, type slash class to start. Class. Um, time to select your class. Wait, I didn't actually explore yet. That's probably a good idea to explore so that you can familiarize yourself with the ship and your surroundings. Anyway, um, we go in here. This is the captain's office. It's a pretty cool design. Um, thought the pistons looked cool, so I added them. Um, there were originally uh, slimes in there, but they drowned, and then I put them behind the glass, behind the water, and I had to disable monster spawning. So there is nothing in the fish tank, but I might add bats, because they can breathe underwater. I think. Maybe. Because they, I don't know. Um, anyway, watch this sign. It's actually a pretty neat thing. It changes. Anyway. Um, so use the turbo lift. I don't have deck B made yet. I only have C and A. So um, I only plan to have three decks so that it's pretty small. I don't want a big ship. Um, anyway, so here's sick bay. This is the captain's office. I mean, not the captain. The doctor's office where he can observe his patient sleeping. Um, operating room thing. Not really a room. Operating table. Anyway, the reason the beds are backwards are because there's a glitch. I think it's in bucket, but you can't place beds that way. You can only place them one direction, and so that's that. Um, just quickly, astrometrics, big screen, buttons, that's actually a furnace, but um, basic ship design. The brig, here are my two prisoners, potential danger, prisoner, blah blah blah. Shields. Very small room. I'm not really going to go into detail. That's why I'm rushing. Um, let's see. Spoiler. Here are some of the crew quarters. Just very small beds, shelves, laptop. Not really a laptop, probably a space laptop. Um, you can probably see in there. This one's actually kind of creepy, but you can download the map and figure that out for yourself when I release it, which should be soon. 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 Um, Anyway, so back to the top, we did slash start, time to do slash class. So time to select your class. If you're playing alone, you should do slash captain. That's what I'm doing for each additional player. Select different classes such as medic, tactical, or scientist. So I'm going to do slash captain. Now Captain Almond 1 to your own ship. Now do you consider yourself aggressive, scientific, or medical slash aggressive, aggressive, aggressive. You are an aggressive captain. Yes, I am. So I have protection 40 iron boots, and I have an unbreaking 3 golden sword, and I'm thinking about adding more items just so that it makes the commands easier because this will be very command based because I don't. It's a lot easier to do that than just like right clicking on colored wools. Um, not so much easier, it's just a hassle for the player. Um, let's see, what else can I talk about? Uh, it is going to be based off of FTL, if you didn't get that already. Uh, FTL is a strategy-based game, so there will be strategy elements to this. Um, the sword is for defending yourself from boarding parties, and yes, there will be boarding parties, which would be pretty cool. Um, I have already set up the variables to the... if this makes any sense, if you are knowledgeable in code at all. I've set up the variables to um, the hull and the system damage thing, so your systems will be damaged, I'm sorry to say. Um, the basic point of this is to survive as long as possible in the treacherous of space, and hopefully I can have some sort of thing where it gets harder and harder, but I don't know. Uh, it's going to be a long time in the making. Um, but yeah, first of all, I just wanted to get the ship layout first, and I think this is going to be pretty cool. Multiplayer map. I've never really done something like this before. Um, other than the bridges, which you should view or check out. Um, yep, don't really have anything else to say, so 
I don't know when this will be released. Um, this is really awkward. Bye.